Nueces County parents are signing an online petition to fight for their children to get back into the classroom. They say the disadvantages outweigh the advantages in keeping students at home for remote learning. New at 10 tonight, Chris 6 News reporter Ashley Portillo spoke to several of those parents and students and has the story. I just saw my daughter just completely lose her love for learning and that just hurt my heart. My children are frustrated and they're stressed out and they're not learning entirely. Those are some of the reasons why Nueces County parents want their children back in the classroom. And parent of four, Anne Marie Bellows worries her children, Brett and Brennan, are falling behind. I haven't been as excited as I was because I know it's not the full experience. I don't get the full experience. I don't get to go to the classes. Sometimes I have problems with my computer and basically if you have problems with your computer or some sort of connection, you effectively don't do school. And while remote learning has been challenging for some students, according to CCISD, about 30% of families have expressed interest in returning to in-classroom learning. CCISD plans on reopening its school buildings on Tuesday, September 8th in a phased approach. Therefore, not every child will be able to return to the classroom right away. It's just another layer of I don't get a choice. I mean, these are my children. My rights as a parent, I feel like, have been violated. The district will finalize their phase reopening plans and keep a close eye on the public health situation. But parent of four, Allison Fosno, is hoping her children are some of the first ones back. And I'm willing to go to any extent that I need to to make sure that that happens because my children's education right now is being robbed. The online petition has more than 200 signatures from parents and those parents plan on presenting it to school leaders. Reporting in Corpus Christi, Ashley Portillo, Chris 6 News. Now, in a statement from CCISD, they did say that once the buildings are open to all students who wish to return, the district will continue to offer remote instruction throughout the school year to all families who prefer it.